The path to a dream home is not an easy one, but the day finally arrives when you are at the doorstep of your dream. And I've got this really beautiful new property in South Bombay. There's nothing there. You're here to help me out with my outdoor space. And that is when I walk into your life to help you complete your masterpiece. But before knowing the space, wow. You need to know the person. What is it that you want to come home to? Not to white walls. Little bit of glitter, little bit of glamour. Clearly, you need help. I surrender my space to you now. That's when I take matters into my own hands. One minute. I love this. The work begins. And we're ready to rock and roll. This space comes to me with multiple challenges. वो हिल तो नहीं जाएगा ना उधर से वो ऊपर से संभाल के Fix this. Worry. Racing against time to deliver perfection. Girls, are we done? Are we done? Are we done? Yeah, fine. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. All good. One final look. But in the end, it's their reactions. Wow. What have you done? <laughs> That makes it all worthwhile. Oh uh -huh. my God! Are we at the same age? This. <laughs> this is home, and this is great. A house, they say, is a place made of bricks and beams, but a home is made of hopes and dreams. It's not only a place where you stay, but it's also a place where your aspirations take flight. Sometimes you might even find it difficult to strike the right balance and make it the kind of place you've dreamt of. But don't you worry, my team and I are here with the perfect solutions to help you transform your home into a good home. Today on Hafla presents the Good Homes Show powered by Vector Projects. We are here to see Alex Sangal and his studio apartment. Let's go. Lights, camera, drama. That's me. Not him. Actor, director, writer, producer. I'm Alex Sangal and I'm someone who loves what I do. Imagine waking up to a stunning mise-en scene. An artist's paradise. A place beautiful and serene a space so imaginative that your ideas take flight your source of inspiration your good home oh, i had got my studio apartment but i had no clue what to do with it i have to say it i needed help when i walked into the apartment the first thing that greeted me was a was a posted at the door who does that blessed is he who in the name of goodwill shepherds the weak to the valley of darkness for he is truly his brother's keeper and the finder of lost children oh my god too much drama alek ronda hi hi my first impression of alek was obviously drama with a capital d isn't it cool this is home fab it's fab it's fab this is and what i have called you for Dude, what is that? It's called the view to die for. The energy, the vibe of the apartment was amazing. It was a nice open space. I loved it. I was dying to get my hands dirty there. Uh, I've been an actor all my life, I think. My mom was an actress. Wow. She was an actress. Have you seen the show called Hum Paanch? Yes. So there was this line from Hum Paanch which used to go, "Auntie mat kaho na." Oh my god. Pooja auntie is my mom. Auntie mat kaho na. That's it. So that was her. So cute. So uh, I kind of grew up with an actress mom i've kind of branched out to be a writer a producer as well jack of all yes exactly just fab and that's fun because you just got to keep your options open you know okay so now i finally found this place raheja sorento it's lovely it's lovely when you open that door what is it that you want to come home to 
not to white walls. Okay. White walls are, they're a canvas on which you can paint and do anything, but I want my canvas to be in my head. And you know, you have like these great filmmakers who, who do a lot with all kinds of colors. Quentin Tarantino oh my God, is okay. my favorite director. And the things he does with color. Tell me more about the colors that you're talking about. I actually like, uh, you know, you know the colors to be a little classy and not jarring. Okay. But little pockets if they do scream out at you. Let's get down to your lifestyle. Give me a few key things that you want to do at home, like that you will be doing at home. I love, love watching my stuff. I love reading. I like my movie books. We'll have okay, movie how nights. important we'll have is the kitchen? Okay. I do like home food, okay. so uh, I would want uh, at least one meal a day. Okay. Yes. And anything else that you think we've missed out that you'd like me to know? This is not a very big space as you're seeing. It's a little studio apartment. Towards the end of the conversation, I kind of knew exactly what he wanted. After a point, I just wanted to snatch the keys from him and tell him to get out. All right. I'm sure in your safe hands, it's going to be the best. Yes, it's going to be a space where you're going to do some great work at, so. But you need to leave now. I knew. Now an artist is going to be at work for the other artist to come back and start working himself. It was time to bring in my team. They're my hands and legs. In came Pinky, my art director, along with the two stylists, Prerna and Zainab. He seems like a fun guy. Very interesting brief. This is the layout. Okay. Three very important zones that we need to establish. Planning those zones out for our lake and yet maintaining that fluidity that he wanted, that was going to be a challenge. It was something that we would have to tackle with a lot of care. This is what we need to kind of figure in terms okay. of getting the space. whole space together. Okay. Tarantino fan? Yes. Okay. Think uh, mood, think dramatic, think Pulp Fiction, think Tarantino. Tell ha, me. Okay. So how about having New York loft? with industrial wine, okay? And giving it very sleek and smart and edgy yeah. look. Very clean. clean Not up. brick wall or anything. Palette. Hmm. Okay. Colors, okay, okay fine, fine. Let's do colors here. Uh, okay, fine. So then okay. greys, greys is safe. You know, I knew that the rest of the space would come together and what we already had in was looking really, really good. You want to put the bed here? Yeah. Yes. Right next to the door. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. The placement of the bed was really, really important here. We wanted Alec to be able to wake up to that beautiful, stunning view that he had there. If this is the window, then how will he get privacy over here? So where else would you think of, like right here in front of the door? That will be too much to get. How about this area? And it's 10 feet, so it's wide enough to have a bed. bed. Yeah, correct. Yeah. Are we good with this being the bed? Yeah, yeah. This area you can mark. So let us do that. This is, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. One area is sorted. Entertaining in the bedroom had to stop. We had to bring him out of there, especially when he needed to watch TV, maybe even working. Let's pull out the trolley from uh, Hapla. I think that would be amazing. Yeah. Small changes can make a big difference. I've got a couple of nifty tips for you to do wonders to your spaces. For one, Dark colors need not necessarily spell dingy rooms. Dark adds mood. It also brings in a lot of drama. And we're looking at comfort and cozy coming together to make a beautiful space for you. And the second tip is, gray is becoming the new neutral. It's smart, it's contemporary, and it's very, very urban. If you want to add that mysterious masculine edge to your space, gray is the color for you. Guys, the first thing that struck me when I walked into Alex's house was that balcony. It's very, very important with a balcony like that to make sure that the railing system is 100% secure. And that's why I'm here at TechnoRail. I'm sitting here with Mr. Sham Kishore Chanasana. He's the man behind TechnoRail, the safest modular railing systems in our country and yes, also the rest of the world. Welcome to the show, Sham. I need help and inputs from you. 
Technol is uh, basically known for the safest railing in the world, as you yes. said. All the design as per the safety standards of the Europe. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Okay. We are considering about the like heat pressure. We are considering about the wind pressure. We are doing a special type of coating on our railings. It's the anti-scratch coating. No fingerprint marks on the, my product. No rust are there. It's a UV protected railing. Sham, you've kind of summed it all up really, really well for me. Thank you very, Thank you. very much. Thank you. I needed Zainab to hit the stores and figure out exactly what it was out there that we could bring home for Alec. Too much shimmer. Ooh, I like. Considering that the windows formed a large part of the house, Roman blinds were the best option. Pinky and Prerna had to stay back home to sort out the blueprint and get started with the other nitty-gritty things that needed to be done. I've got butterflies in my stomach. The team is out there trying to figure out the accessories that uh, they're really so excited about. I'm trying to figure out how to give Alec those zones and yet maintain that fluidity that he wants. But I have the perfect person to go to. The high point being that he's also a bachelor himself. Let me go get him and pick his brains about it. I'm with uh, Asim Merchant. He's one of the most brilliant, creative designers that I've met. I'm here to pick your brains about this fabulous space that belongs to this guy called Alec. He's another creative person. Tarantino fan. So you're looking at like a bachelor party pad. Right. One of the biggest issues is he wants to keep the space open. So what you can do is you can, you know, introduce screens and those screens are, uh, you know, they're invisible when you don't need them. So you create a false wall kind of a thing and those screens just go. You can make these screens with uh, rice paper, oh, okay. with, uh, you know, stained like glass. Yes. Completely different dimension to right. the space, no? Okay, so the other thing that we've, we've been talking about with the team, how do we bring in that Tarantino connection? So you could put up a few posters. Ideally, a large poster would be nice instead of putting many one of large. them. Yeah, just one large Massive. poster in the colours that work for the space. And uh, also what you can do is you can introduce the same colours from the poster into yeah. upholstery, cushions. Like. It will look stunning. It will look I'm stunning. Sure. Thank you. I'm gonna see you soon, okay? See you. Soon. Bye -bye. See you. Bye. Bye. Asim was fabulous. He gave me just the right ideas that I needed to work the space out. We got down to building the screen that Asim had recommended. We left it light with glass panels and yet at the same time demarcated the zone very, very strongly. We finally found the perfect bed for Alec. It had just the right amount of drama and a nice modern twist to it. One of the most exciting things about the girls sourcing was the light above the island kitchen with the bookshelf. They're from two different stores and yet there's great synergy. something that is wall ceiling as well as a floor lamp. We are looking for something boxy, okay. something which is a central um, crystal chandelier mix variety, okay. something okay. for the wall, wall brackets okay. that we want to try and use sure. also. One cage light, we've got the triangular light here. Thank you so much. Thank you. I think we've Pleasure. got most of our lights here. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. One of the most important pieces that I need to sort out is the kitchen. The Hafla team was a dream to work with. They knew exactly what I wanted, how I wanted it, and in what color I needed it. The kind of profile that we had of Alec 
we knew that the couch would play an important role in his life. I think this is the one. And the folding details. This is incredible. The kind of space this was turning into, we were really, really excited about it. Now, with all the big pieces sorted out, we needed to get down to the smaller accessories. Considering the rest of the palette, we needed to bring in color to make it pop. We had the perfect chair in mind to do that. Grey was a good choice for this room. Got a nice, healthy bachelor vibe going. This is something that I'm extremely excited about. It's a very modern sort of touch to the entire look and feel that we wanted to create for uh, Alex. So I like. Now this baby, I'm really, really excited about. I'm very, very grateful to the Hafla team for pulling this off for me. What I'm also very happy about here is that we've managed to get him an induction hog. That is something that I thought is ideal for the kind of lifestyle that he has. So happy that we could get this bed organized. It's one handsome piece and the girls were really excited about it. I'm so proud of them and I'm so excited that they could get it here in time. I'm keeping my fingers crossed because there are lots of deliveries expected yet. So I'm going to go about and get those done. You guys wait and watch what the place looks like finally. We don't have time. Alex should be here any minute and uh, I really want to get all the finishing touches uh, done before he enters because I think the first impression is always a lasting impression. Balance. It was the other way around. The red's getting lost. We needed to get down to the smaller accessories because those were what would add character to the space. Isn't this also supposed to be the phone stand? Yeah, I think the, I think the bookshelf is looking much better with the books filled in, no? Very, very important elements. The bookshelf was one very integral piece to this entire New York loft story. When are we going to set this seat from Vector? Is it straight? Can you just check? Because this bed is not done. What is wrong with you? And why do we have a computer here? No working in the bedroom. Please okay. get it off. Okay, okay. Option? What's the option here? This is the clapboard. This is yeah. the clapboard. Yeah. Perfect, yeah. perfect. And you yeah. layer the cushions and the pillows. Yes, yes, we are doing. Yeah. Now from there, it's a line. Perfect. Yeah. I think we are pretty sorted. It was time to give Alec a taste of his own medicine. We're also capable of drama. What is drama but life with dull bits cut out? I mean, the suspense is building. I think I'm ready. I walked into a house and I checked, where am I? What is this place? There was this massive clock when I walked in. There was a Scarface book at the entrance. When Alec walked in, it was a treat to see the expression on his face. There was a massive Django Unchained poster to the right. And then there was this huge shelf with books, my toys, and you know, there was a gun cup. I was just like, whoa, this is home. And this is great. It was a couch which was not actually taking up the space but fitting in absolutely perfectly like the couch was already there. This is damn good. This, this, this feels like home and much more. This is an island kitchen. Island kitchen? Yes, it's called an island kitchen. If you notice, it's in the middle of the space. You've got space there, you've got space there. Where's the shoe rack? Really, let me show you. Carefully. Whoa! And you've got your bar. That's the business end of the house. <laughs> yes. 
he was like a little child in a candy store and you know what that's one of the best reactions i've ever had to my work the bedroom it was like a like a separate room had been pulled out of nowhere oh my god we thought it was nice and dramatic for you <laughs> You got a clap clock. We did. Oh my god, this is so cool. So my studio apartment had actually been converted into one bedroom hall kitchen. What Alik doesn't know is that we have one more surprise planned for him and this, believe me, is going to be the cherry on the cake. There's more. Yes. Are we not done yet? Give me a count. Okay. 1 2 3 This is so cool. The TV just pops up like this. Please note that it's mobile, it's modular, it can be taken anywhere in the room. So that is the joy of having a unit like this. Narada, thank you from the bottom of my heart. I can't, I can't thank you enough for this. This, this is hands down one of the greatest moments of my life. It is. You have your own house and you have this house. Handing your good home. Thank you, thank you. It's all yours. Enjoy it and all the best. Thank you, good homes. Thank you, Ronita. A home is a living thing. Every brick, every wall has character, which not only defines the space but also defines you in the truest sense. We are here to help you with it. This is me, Ronita Italia Danu, signing off. See you next time on another episode of Half Love Presents The Good Homes Show powered by Vector Projects.